For the past decade, the Florida Botanical Gardens in Largo has offered itself as an oasis of tranquility and beauty in the heart of Pinellas County. Demonstration gardens provide the home gardener with ideas for sustainable horticulture and pathways through this floral wonderland with its many unique plant varieties and lovely water features make this one of Pinellas County's most attractive destinations for residents and tourists alike. Ever on the lookout for new ways to enhance the experience of visitors, the Florida Botanical Gardens Foundation held its first Dig in the Arts event back in May. Well, we decided that we wanted to have art in the garden, and the goal was to promote the garden. And uh, in the springtime, it's so beautiful, we wanted everybody to uh, come and see it. And uh, art is a perfect partnership in other cities art and the botanical gardens are a natural and it's proved to be the same for us. We had museums and art centers that came. They participated with booths and they brought their representatives so that it was a different venue for them. It was a win-win situation. In addition to that we had a plain air art competition which brought artists into the garden and the garden was just alive with their uh, paint. People enjoyed watching the artists. Plain air means fresh air fresh air art competition. The artists come in in the morning, they register, they paint a scene in the garden, anywhere on the path, and then at 3.30, they had the uh, competition at that point, and we had three judges who were very well qualified. The artists were delighted with it, and everybody else was very pleased. It's something that will continue. Next year, it will be expanded, pre-registration, and we hope to have a lot more artists. We also had uh, rain barrels that the um, art centers and museums decorated. We had an opportunity drawing and people could uh, uh, choose their rain barrel and they were big hits. They were absolutely beautiful. Each one was different. We had garden tours, we had uh, vendors, we had a few vendors and then we also had some musicians. We had uh, an orchid guru who uh, shared his expertise. It was wonderful. And uh, the whole ambience was just beautiful. And we had sunny skies and it was a beautiful day. Well, where do we go from here? Uh, this year was very successful. So next year is already planned. We have the date, it's Sunday, May 5th, 2013. We hope everybody comes. So there you have it. The next Dick in the Arts event will be held on Sunday, May 5th, 2013. But don't wait till then to come out and visit the gardens. They're open daily, year-round, at 7 a.m. to dusk, and admission is free. And don't forget the special annual holiday lights display at the Botanical Gardens. This year's event is scheduled for November 23rd through January 1st. So mark your calendars, because it's a local tradition and family favorite that only gets better every year. The Florida Botanical Gardens, located right next to Heritage Village at 12520 Olmerton Road in Largo. For information, visit flbg.org or call area code 727-582-2100.